This is Mike Mangini from Dream Theater. I'm going to give you a walkthrough of my beautiful brand new Pearl drum set. I made the switch from Birch, which I used in the studio on Distance Over Time, to a full maple kit for the first time. I wanted an extra level of punch live. Another difference is that I removed the two smallest drums, given I have the, uh, the hamster tubes to hit up top. There are more big drums in front of me, and my drum set is a mirror image. The biggest reason for that is so my arms don't cross, I can orchestrate a little more, I can reach a little better, and I can control myself and keep my balance centered. I recommend you try it. Throw a floor tom on your left side just to get that big boom. It might be fun. A major change was to add gong floor toms. I have been thinking for years and talking with my tech, Eric, about how difficult it is sometimes to get a double-headed drum to just have one tone. We seem to have so much noise going around that they resonate a lot. So it's like, why don't we try one drum head? And it's turned out to have a tremendous effect out front. I mean, it's just huge, because you're just getting this one clean tone. I'm a double bass player, and there is, uh, as far as I can see, one bass drum here. My tech, Eric, took two Demon Drive pedals and uh, just did some Lego, you know, work with them and just reset them so that they're split. In other words, I'm using a slave on each side while the beaters are off the middle of the drum head, so I'm getting the same sound out of each. The icon rack is strong enough that um, no matter what I put up there, it's not going to move. And I do have quite a bit of weight up there, as you can see. The reason for the structural look, basically so I can see and be seen by my bandmates and also by the audience. Both my kick drum and my snare drum are standard stock reference line drums. The bass drum is a 24 by 18, and the snare drum is a 14 by six and a half. Uh, the snare drum is 20 plies, 16 of maple, <laughs> and four of birch. And uh, this bad Larry here is mahogany and maple. I'm using two snare drums. The one in the center here is uh, it's the same spec that my old signature snare drum was. 10 inch by the golden ratio of 6.2 inches. I basically use it for two purposes. I orchestrate snare drum patterns such that a tighter, smaller sound helps my dynamics. And the second thing that I do is that I turn the snare off and I use it as a high tom. I know that nobody can see my pedals from the front. My main concern here was just keeping a lot of the sound out of the gong drums. Also, I have extra electronic pedals there, percussion and things like that. It just looks like a lot of stuff and I didn't quite like the look of it. So more of us like the look of the black barrier, so that's why they're there. I have been with Pearl Drums since a day in 1999 at NAMM where I walked around to many, many, many booths and hit drums. I'll not forget walking into the Pearl booth and hitting one of their floor toms, and it happened to be a birch drum. And that's part of the reason why a lot of my drum sets have birch in them, was that experience and the way that it made me feel. So that's what drew me in. They adapt to any need that um, one could have. They developed the, the, or redeveloped the cable hi-hat for me. Different size uh, icon rack pieces. Uh, we have the gong drums. Uh, we did an, you know, an, an odd size with the signature snare. Pearl has adjusted to all of these things. I don't know how you can get a better drum than to call Pearl and get a Masterworks and just get what you want made. So they can accommodate anybody and their stock drums are, I, I'm using them. So they're absolutely outrageously fantastic. And if you wanted a, a, uh, an extra reinforcement hoop in some or to change the bearing edge, bang. It's been a great relationship with the people. They are family to me now. I'm just, I don't know what else, look at my face. I'm still here and I'm very happy about it. I, when you hear the drum sound, you'll know why. Pearl, the best reason to play drums. <laughs>